you guys are watching Zack Slider TV, and I'm making a video on my planted shrimp tank, which is two weeks through its cycling process. I'll probably let it go another week just for the heck of it for my shrimp because they feed off of beneficial bacteria and stuff or the microorganisms in the tank. I'm not going to go too f deep into it. I'll make another video later about it if you want me to, but. And there's not a lot of viewers for my channel anyways, but for those of you who subscribed, the Jungle Val actually came out to here, which is pretty amazing. It was all clumped out right here. This is a new sprout right here. There's a new sprout back there, and the Cryptocorins, uh, the Spiralis, they were all curled up like this and now they've straightened out. Microsword is getting a nice green color and I put a few lilies in here and I just put some in a couple days ago and uh, they, they started growing better and the, the dwarf sag I had in my 55 it was, it was dying off, it was melting and just like that, it grew back again. That back here only had two leaves on it, and that's how far it went. And the crypts back there, they're making new runners. It's just amazing. The power of dirt, you know? Miracle Grow Organic Choice Potting Mix. That's what I have. Good stuff. I'm using a, um, pretty sure this is a Zoom Ed light from my local fish store. It's one of the sunlight bulbs. It's not T5, I think it's T8. And, uh, they can look real nice. And, uh, Rosala has grown pretty well. It was about right around here when I first got it. Now it's all the way up there. I gotta trim it back. I think, let me know whether you have, a. Uh, any ideas whether I should trim this Amazon sword off yet or wait till it gets built? Um, see, here's my hand compared to it. Actually, I'll stick my hand in the tank, even though I don't really want to, but just for comparison. Because I trimmed them off last time, and when I trimmed them off last time, they started, the leaves started melting. See, here's my finger comparison to the sword. I think it needs to grow a little bit longer to reach about I don't know. I think I might want to dirt this tank too. Get some uh, new lighting on the left side. Get it rolling. Get an Amazon tank rolling. Get rid of the guppies. And uh, the coolie loaches, the black coolie loaches. I'm, not, I'm just going to get uh, the plain striped ones, the Pangeo coolies. But these are, um, these can't coexist with discus, and I wanted to get at least three discus for this 55. It's going to be so planted, it's not even funny. Um, as you can see, the rotala is growing through the gravel too. It's got a really nice rooting system on there. Look on the other side. If you can see it. No, you can't. Pleco has been pulling out the Amazon sword. He was just out a little while ago. He saw me walking around in here. 
getting ready for this video and he took off. It's like a ghost town over here. I'm playing a jungle over here. There's a quarry cat. I need to get him some more buddies. That's probably what I'm going to get next time I go. I'll make a video of my local fish store. I always, I always do, but I never upload them because they're like 15 minutes long. There's a lot to see in that store. Alright, um, be sure to rate, comment, subscribe. And, uh, see you guys later.